you'll notice here that all the numbers let me just highlight them that we're dividing by 10 are the same as in the video where we times by 10 and that's on purpose so uh, what's different really stands out compared to when we times by 10 so the first thing you should say is they're going to get smaller because divide by 10 is like sharing if you imagine these sums as money between 10 people or as sweets between 10 people they're not going to get more than the number of sweets you had to share it's just not possible so it must get less great so same idea but this time instead of the numbers moving left they're going to move right by one so here's the decimal and if I move all those numbers and the decimal stays where it is the zero is now either side of the decimal 10 people sharing 700 euros each get 70 so same again 10 has one zero so this is going to move one place to the right the decimal is here the numbers move around that decimal one place the decimal is here there's one zero the numbers move around that decimal one place to the right it can help it's clearer just to put a zero before the decimal so we can read that number easily the decimals here the numbers going to move one place back away from the decimal when it does it leaves a gap that we fill with a zero so if I had 70 cents 70 pence 70 cents euros pounds dollars and you divide that between 10 people it makes sense they're each going to get seven cents now we've got seven cents divided by 10 there's the decimal the numbers the decimal stays where it is the numbers move around that one place to the right it's going to move one place to the right so now there's two zeros after the decimal rather than just one and that's zero point zero zero seven just writing that more neatly 230 euros pounds dollars divide by 10 they all move one place right the decimal is currently here it stays where it is and the numbers move around that one place to the right the decimals here the numbers move one place around that the decimal is now in between the two and the three because the numbers moved one right the decimals here the numbers move around that one place to the right both the two and the three are now behind the decimal the decimals here the number moves around that they go back one right leaving a gap just before the decimal that we fill with a zero we have now divided all of those numbers by 10 by moving them one place to the right try these questions pause the video now press play when you're ready to see the solutions and check yours welcome back we're now doing the solutions so the decimals here there's one zero so all the numbers move one right and the word digits is quite helpful when you're talking about individual single numbers digits so the digits each of these are going to move one place backwards one place sorry yeah right or backwards depends which way and that's 40.0 there's one zero there's a decimal the numbers move one place right there's a decimal the numbers move one place right you can put a zero there if that helps make more sense to you or not it doesn't change the size or the reading of the number a zero is often helpful though to relate it to money if that's four pounds or four dollars or four euros then it makes sense if you share four euros between ten people they each get forty cents forty cents point four euros pounds dollars point four one zero so it moves one place right it creates a gap between the decimal and the four which we fill with a zero if you share forty cents between 10 people they each get 4 cents 40 pence 4 pence depending which currency so same 
all the digits move one place to the right, the decimal stays where it is, but that creates a gap between the zero and the decimal, which we fill with a zero, point zero zero four. There's the decimal, all the numbers move one place right. There's the decimal, all the numbers move one place right. There's the decimal, all the numbers move one place right. The eight is now the other side of the decimal. There's the decimal, all the numbers move one place right. There is now a zero on the right side of the decimal. The decimal stays where it is and all the numbers move because there's one zero in the number 10, one place right, the decimal is now in between the twos. There's the decimal, all the numbers move one place right, the four has moved to the right side of the decimal. All the numbers move one place right, the two has moved to the right side of the decimal. There's the decimal. Both eights are now the, the right hand side of the decimal. Those are the final answers. Check yours. Well done if you're all correct or if you only made one mistake. That's great.